Hi, welcome in. God's promises for your every need. New King James Version, purchased at Hobby Lobby for $9.59. Thomas Nelson Publishing. Jesus is your Savior. Jesus is your Savior. Not by works of righteousness, which we have done, but according to his mercy, he saved us through the washing of regeneration and renewing of the Holy Spirit, whom he poured out on us abundantly through Jesus Christ, our Savior. Titus 3, verses 5 to 6. For by grace you have been saved through faith, and that not of yourselves. It is the gift of God, not of works, lest anyone should boast. Ephesians 2, verses 8 to 9. And we have seen and testified that the Father has sent the Son as Savior of the world. 1 John 4, 14. For we ourselves have heard him, and we know that this is indeed the Christ, the Savior of the world. John 4, verse 42. For the Son of Man has come to seek and to save that which was lost. Luke 19, verse 10. Being justified freely by his grace through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus, whom God set forth as a propitiation by his blood through faith to demonstrate his righteousness, because in his forbearance God had passed over the sins that were previously committed. Romans 3, verses 24 to 25. But God, who is rich in mercy because of his great love with which he loved us, even when we were dead in trespasses, made us alive together with Christ. By Christ you have been saved. Ephesians 2, verses 4 to 5. That if you confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in your heart that God has raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10, verse 9. And my spirit has rejoiced in God, my Savior. Luke 1, verse 47. Most assuredly, I say to you, he who believes in me has everlasting life. John 6, verse 47. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whoever believes in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. John 3, verse 16. Who has saved us and called us with a holy calling, not according to our works, but according to his own purpose and grace, which was given to us in Christ Jesus before time began. 2 Timothy 1, verse 9. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation, Old things have passed away. Behold, all things have become new. 2 Corinthians 5, verse 17. Nevertheless, he saved them for his name's sake, that he might make his mighty power known. Psalm 106, verse 8. 